How's your energy? Southern Arizona It is now time for the highly acclaimed, much anticipated Friday football fever. Good evening to you. I'm Paul C. Cullen. I'd also like to welcome our newest member of the KVOA <laughs> sports team, Dave Kelly. Welcome aboard, my friend. Well, thank you very much, Paul. It's great to be here at KVOA. I've been covering the sports here in Tucson for over a decade now, and I'm looking forward to continuing that here on the Friday football fever. And we're certainly happy to have you. Are you ready for this? I am. I'm ready. Let's, Let's do it. Do Let's it. do it. Yeah. Let's begin with the Friday football fever game of the week. It is one of the longest running rivalries in Tucson's history. Sabino and Saguaro, the 46th battle of the East Side Bragging Rights. 41st game to honor the late Saguaro quarterback Rick Botkin. And the first play of the game for the Cougars who have 750 yards rushing this season. How about Jameer Gassaway? Put the gas in his ride because he's going away. 61 yards. I think Sabino's uh, Ethan Allegra almost hit me there, but I survived. Seven zip Saguaro. Savino, though, would answer with one of the longest drives in the history of football. A.J. Skaggs on the slant route here to Diego Armillo, and we are all tied at 7-7. Ryan McBrayer hoping his team could eat clock like that all night long. Wasn't going to happen. Did I mention the Saguaro ground game? Trevion Watkins, he's an 11th grader. 42 yards straight up the gut. Kid can play some mean linebacker, too. 14-7. Cougars back on top and ready to take over or maybe turn over. That's what A.J. Skaggs does. Kalen McFarland with the pick, and this is not going to end well for the Sabercats. That pick is a six touchdown Saguaro. Cougars roll over rival Savino. First time since 1987-88. Saguaro has won this rivalry game in back-to-back -back years. 